Hey guys, welcome back. I'm here having a turkey sandwich and I'm watching Stranger Things. I'm watching season three, like out of all of them. I love all of them, but season three is my favorite. Mm. So good. And I'm having Stacy's pita chips. These are multi-grain. They're so good. Mm. They're super crunchy. But yeah, I haven't watched Stranger Things in a while. And recently, I saw the trailer for season four. And I'm so excited for it to come out, you guys. Oh my God, I can't wait. But I think that's gonna be the last season. I don't think they're gonna make any more. Honestly, if you think about it, these kids are growing. Like, what else are they going to do with this show? You know, like, too much already. I'm having water. So, yeah. Just wanted to say hi. <clears throat> so, quick little mukbang. <laughs> Oh. Got light mayo and just one slice of the turkey. It's actually honey smoked turkey. So these kids from Stranger Things, like I follow them on on Instagram. And they look so different now, you guys. Like, they totally do not look like that anymore. They've grown so much. So, I don't know why David is assuming this. I don't know if it's something that he read, an article, or just from watching the trailer to season four but i don't know why he thinks that maybe they're gonna kill off l 11 oh my god i hope they don't but that would really suck like the fans would be so pissed off if that happened <laughs> but i love i love stranger things i have this little picture frame that David got me. I forgot where it was that we found it. And I still haven't put it up. This is Stranger Things um, picture frame. Mm. So good, you guys. Mm. <laughs> But, um, just wanted to get on here, share my little lunch with you guys, and just share like a positive message <clears throat> with you guys out there. And I'll just tell you to each day focus on you, focus on yourself, not others. And just think daily, positive thoughts each day, daily. Mm. Even those days that are harder to stay positive for whatever reason, try and find one positive thing in each day. Even if it's just one. 
And trust me, you'll find tons. <laughs> you'll find more than one, trust me. This brings back so many childhood vibes. <laughs> the 80s were the best. Right. There's so many things that I love about this show. The fact that it's centered around the 80s. But, you know, the fact that it's like supernatural, scary horror, or whatever. And set in the 80s. It's perfect. Hmm. <laughs> People always say that Will's character is so <laughs> is so dramatic like the kid all he does is cry. <laughs> Poor kid though, like he's gone through hell like Leave him alone. <laughs> Nancy. I like her character as well. Mm. That crunch is awesome. You guys, these pita chips are so good. Like I said, they're multi-grain. They're so good with hummus. Hummus. <laughs> they're really awesome. Everything looks so authentic in this show, though, from the 80s. I'm like, I know. Even though it was many decades ago, like all these things from the 80s, as a child, is still very fresh in my memory. And I could still remember even like what the furniture looked like. A lot of like patterns for like kitchen stuff, like kitchenware and everything. And I'm telling you right now that this show nailed it with the 80s aesthetic. They nailed it. Mm hmm. <laughs> and they did a pretty good job nailing this <laughs> the 80s to the T mm. so good oh the sandwich is on whole wheat 100% whole wheat bread delicious Dusty. All right. Sandwich all gone. <laughs> well, you guys, I hope you have a lovely day. I am done with my lunch. I hope you guys enjoyed. And as always, I will see you on my very next video. Bye, guys.